Yale Urology is really a, a unique place. It's a great environment to train in. We have a really family-oriented spirit. There's a real camaraderie here. It's a very collaborative environment. What makes us unique is the people involved, and we cover all aspects of urology. Our ultimate goal as a department is to train future leaders in urology. So what that means is that all three tripartite missions are critical. The state-of-the-art clinical training, innovative science, and really a great educational curriculum. It's a big program, but it has a small program feel. So we have huge case volume, stars in their field teaching us, but at the same time you get that family sense. I think what makes our residency so strong is a very diverse environment for the residents to train in. We have all three types of clinical training available here, from a large academic hospital to a community hospital, and even a veterans hospital. So I think most residency programs are primarily focused at the academic center, but here at Lawrence Memorial Hospital, we give them an opportunity to see what it's like outside of that environment. One nice thing about our department is we've been able to bring some of that specialty to the community. So we're doing robotics, we're doing uh, some complex stone procedures, uh, but just in a different setting. And I think a picture of kind of what the world's like for most people who don't practice in a major academic medical center. I think it's important to have patients from uh, diverse backgrounds, uh, different economic backgrounds, uh, facing different social and health challenges. We also have significant diversity amongst our faculty, where they've trained, who they've trained with, and their subspecialties. We have a number of faculty who deal with oncology, endourology, and stone disease, my area, neurogenic bladder voiding dysfunction. We have reconstructive urology. We have female pelvic medicine reconstructive surgery and urology and fertility. We have advanced techniques in BPH management from minimally invasive techniques such as the Eurolift and aquablation to HOLEP procedures. Here at Yale University, we have one of the most rich environments for research, whether it's basic science or clinical research. We have a lot of resident research opportunities in both the urologic cancer field, stone disease, and in benign urology. During the entire training, our residents are expected to engage in innovative and important research throughout the entire training. And then in terms of education, we've talked a lot about sort of the on-the-job training, but just as important is conferences, didactic lectures, surgical skills training. We have access to two simulation centers. That includes an actual Da Vinci robot, as well as laparoscopic trainers and open surgical skill training. Uh, these are very accessible within the hospital itself, so uh, residents can use these resources whenever possible. There is a real positive interaction and relationship between the residents and the faculty. We collaborate and think through processes and issues together. We come up with plans together. The players help the coach succeed and the coach helps the players succeed. You know, the residents are really invaluable to our practices. We spend, you know, long full days in the operating room and in the clinic, and that's where those relationships are formed. And our program directors actually meet with us once a month just to make sure everything is going well. Um, you know, we have mentors that are assigned to us. Our faculty are some of our closest friends. We feel so well supported, not only in the OR, but also outside of the OR. It feels like I've known these people my whole life. You know, we laugh, we have a good time, we support each other, we encourage each other, and I really do love that about this program. So I think the department is very committed to diversity, equity, and inclusion, and, and, and community support. We are committed to recruiting, retaining, and promoting individuals from a diversity of backgrounds. And we want to be able to identify and help ameliorate disparities in access to urologic care and outcomes of that care as well. And the only way we can do that is to have those diverse perspectives represented. We have a number of women, we have a number of people of color uh, within the program, and I think we all come from different places. And we've instituted a DEI committee to making sure that DEI permeates all aspects of our department. Yale Urology has always valued all the voices at the table 
and encourage people speaking up. I think wellness is very important and something we're very focused on and invested in. We've instituted a dedicated curriculum for advancing uh, the wellness of our uh, residents and that just doesn't mean taking time off or, or fewer work hours, but uh, holistically approaching wellness. We're teaching them uh, self-care, uh, we're teaching them financial wellness, uh, we're teaching them mental health wellness. You know, monthly we try to like focus on something that provides wellness, whether that be exercise, you know, a Fitbit challenge, or um, just kind of social activities among the residents. When I started residency, I expected that I would never see my partner, I would never have a time to do anything or explore other activities, and that has not been the case. Uh, attendings do care that we get home, that we're not being overworked. You know, they really seem cognizant of that, and it's appreciated. They truly believe that that um, it's not the amount of hours you spend in the hospital, but it's the content of what you're doing in the hospital. New Haven is a very nice mid-sized city. It's big enough to offer you anything you'd want to be able to do from really good restaurants to bars to entertainment. At the same time, uh, it's small enough. Every hospital we work out here in the area is about a 10 minute drive from where most people live in the downtown New Haven area. Uh, it's also pretty close to New York and Boston, so there's always a quick detour if they need to, to get away for a little bit. It's rarely you're in a hospital where out of one window you see the mountains and the other one you see the ocean. It's truly beautiful. New Haven is awesome. I love New Haven. It has people from every walk of life. It's very diverse, very alive. It's a unique place, a special place. You all should consider Yale strongly because it is a special place that is able to combine excellent clinical training, exposure to all urologic subspecialties, an emphasis on research that is more than supported by our department and Yale as a whole institution. This is a program where people care about you, where they'll advocate for you. Whatever direction you take, I think they'll support you and help propel your career. If you're looking for a program where you're going to be the best version of yourself, but also have a fun and challenging time, then it comes to Yale Urology. I think it's really important that our residents, even the most junior resident, recognize that they are a leader in the healthcare team. It's really rooted in a kind of a deep respect for the resident as a human being, and partly really embracing that idea of discovery. And that's really the resident discovering more about themselves. Change is ever present, and we have a program here that embraces that, that we want our residents to change, that we want them to investigate the world, we want them to be the best version of who they are.